Oh, that's much better. Oh, here's my bed. <laughs> There we go. And for some reason not getting much in the way of audio from the desktop. There we go. Get the mic down a little bit because that's just far too loud. Da 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 da. Get the game sound up. Yay! It should balance out fairly well, I think. There we go. It's got a great soundtrack in this game. Bobbing along on the bottom of the beautiful briny sea. Ooh, what's this? Let's have a look. Hello. Ooh. Steam engine. We're gonna have to release the steam at some point. Yeah, there we go. a little bit because I think that's going to be just too loud. There we go. Right, I think we need more energy. More energy! Let's go. Okay, this is fairly self-explanatory this game. I'm guessing I'm going to have to use that as a pull thing at some point. There we go. 
Bulping along on the bottom of the beautiful briny sea. A bit like you're an engineer or something. I played a little bit of this last night, um, but it was only literally like up until I got to the to the uh, Looks so useful. I think I think that might stop it from rolling off. Maybe. Oh, need more energy. Oh, hello. This is pretty cool. Very beautiful game. Let's get some more energy in there. Come on. How do you get? Okay, got some more energy here. Stop! There we go. La la la. It's quite abundant, really, in terms of most survival games you play. Hopefully there gets to be like a better way of picking this stuff up as we go. There we go. I got that song stuck in my head. Oh, can I go to the top of the... Hello. Ahoy there, my hearties. We'll use this one now. There we go, come on, there we go. Ooh. And off we pop. Build up a beautiful head of steam. Then we release the steam and then we can go faster. There we go. Some more steam there. Let's get that in. There must be more to the game than this. I'm thinking a bit of puzzling, maybe, along the lines. Beautiful briny sea. Here we go. Oh, that filled us right up. Said the mother to the hen. <laughs> now what I mean? Here we go, here we go. One more, and then we are on our way. I'll take go backwards, go forwards. There we go. Come 
come on. Boom. I don't know whether I'm meant to wait for the red light to flash or whether I'm meant to get it before the red light starts flashing. Seems to actually give us more if we go before the red light starts flashing. something there. Got to pick this stuff up, baby. Let's go. On the bottom of the beautiful brine, you see. Oh, I'm on fire. What's this? Oh, I see. I got a little fire hose. That'll do me. Oh, oh. There we go. What's that? <gasps> Is that why it's called Lone Sails? Because I actually get to sail this thing across the land. Like a land... Land surfer. Oh, dude. I'm super excited. Here we go. Intense music playing. Little buzzer thing up here, look. Uh, oh, fuck yeah. We got this. Got this. Let's uh, fill up our energy whilst we're waiting for that to go off. Oh, hi there, me hearties. No, don't go down. Don't go down. Don't go down. City wind sails. Here we go, Siv. End of the salad. Ahoy there! This is a this is a really cool game. This is my island in the sun. Yeah. Is that a piano? We can play the piano. Can we stop and play the piano? That's good. No, I don't think so. Oh well. Yeah, very much, uh, very much reminds me of the journey or journey on the PSN. Just the way it plays. Very quaint, very easy, but somewhat fun to do. Just a nice, simple, easy journey. Just uh, so cool. I'm sure there'll be other things to pick up as we go. Seems to be an awfully long section of nothing much happening. Oh, here we go. Should we get on the brake? We should get on the brake, really, just in case. 
I'm gonna start bashing into things. Hey. Oh. Here we go. I'm gonna bash into this. Okay. Let's uh pick up some things. I think we can burn pretty much anything, so let's pop that in there. I don't know what that is. It looks like food or something. I can't seem to pick that up. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, little underneath bit here. Ding, ding, ding. Whoa, 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 chill bit. Oh, is that a canyon below us? Yeah, it is. Quick, 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 quick. There we go. There we go. It's uh, still got the wind blowing, so we might as well continue. Uh, have I got the brake on? That's probably why. Come on, let's go. Yo 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 Hi there Ye land lovers bash into something again. I need something on the front that will help me bash into things without doing too much damage to the ship. I worry about there being damage to my beautiful boat. My land boat of beautifulness. Come on boy, you can make it up there. I'm sure all that wind Blow you forthwith. Here we go. Oh, coming up to something now. Uh, get the brakes on, quick, 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 quick. Let's get the brakes on. One, two, three. Oh, look at that for breakage. Wouldn't you believe it? Uh, oh, yeah, that's pretty good for energy, that is. Oh, that's got energy as well. Whee! It's rock and roll, baby cakes. Chicka chicka slim shady hotter than a set of twin babies oh no 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 don't do that I didn't mean to do that I wasn't paying attention what a silly old boy you're being there you go take the sails down now I think must be ah look at the look at the look at the, look at the. Might be something on the other side of the drawbridge. Might help us lower this. Ah, hello. Why is that not working? Does that need energy too? Maybe, that, maybe that's what it needs. Try that. Oh! Tis I, the clever bunny. What's that there? Oh, it's a light. Here we go. Dim, 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 dim. I look like I've got light on my feet. Yeah, I'm light on my feet. <laughs> oh, such a dad joke. Yeah. Uh. 
Okay, okay. Oh. Oh, I broke it. Can I not? Uh. Give me a bit of light in here. La 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 la. Okay, let's punch it. I might need to actually wait until it uh, flashes red to get that spoon beast that I want. Three, two, one. There we go. That's more like it. I don't think we've got any wind. That flag is blowing. Isn't blowing. We need some more energy though, that's for sure. This up as we're here. Ta -da. At least then we don't run out. Eh? Ooh, 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 ooh. There we go. Yeah, let's go, 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 go. in our path. Let's have a look and see what that is. It's like a pizza box or something. Every little helps as Tesco says. stuff. What's that? That looks like something cool. Does that give us more energy as well? What is that? That looks like a spark plug or something. Is it a spark plug? Hmm, it's weird. It looks like a spark plug. Don't know where you would fit that. There we go. Let's bring the barrels in. That way we've got plenty of energy. Oh, things are getting dark now. You see a my little red, red flag on the top that's pointing the other way. So I don't think those sails are going to be any use at this stage. I'm just going to have to use the energy from my uh, from my steam roller. Am I Mexican? No, dude, I'm not Mexican, no. <laughs> I'll be fat gun. <laughs> No, I'm not Mexican. What makes you think that? Push, 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 push. There we go, in you go. Ooh, that wind's picking up. Awful Mexican, my head. <laughs> I'm not getting the references, guys. 
<laughs> oh, wait. oh, my character! Yeah, it looks like uh, either a poncho or... I don't know, I think it's meant to be like an engineer's outfit. I'm sort of like this mini engineer. That's the impression I'm getting anyway. Maybe Mexican. Let's have a look. Very close. Yeah, like a raincoat or a poncho, yeah. Oh wait. There's energy there. I'll just run it over. Maybe it's not effective if I run it over. Is the sound alright guys? Because I don't really know at this stage. This is coming through really loudly on my headphones. <laughs> all over the Daily Mail. <laughs> Very good. Very good. I'm white too, so I'm going to be in a double whammy. <laughs> Oh, I'm on fire, I'm on fire, I'm on fire! Woo! 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 Quick, 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 us! Put the fire out! Oh, that's fucked. That looks, that looks like it's damaged. Oh, shit. Oh, is that gonna work? Oh, it looks like it's, it looks like it's okay for now. Bit of a push. Harry and Megan's friend in racist gaming stream. <laughs> yeah. I've never been accused of it myself, but uh, I can sympathise with people who have. You know, just for saying like the the simplest wrong thing. I mean, so if you're out, if you say outright things like uh, like uh, uh, PewDiePie did recently. And you're really asking for it, aren't you? But you know, there's certain times when it's come out, and everybody's quick to jump to that whole like, "Oh, you're racist," you know. It's like, oh, dudes, really. And it's over the littlest thing as well. I think when you start doing stuff like that, it just sort of belittles the actual racism that people suffered back in the day. You know, the proper type of racism where people would actually want to, uh, yeah, start killing people because they didn't match up to you, your standard what a normal character is. Your character in the game is racist. What game is that? Ah, uh, this is definitely not going as fast as before. I think I've done some damage to this now. That storm has really done some some damage. Oh, gotta let the steam off before I blow up. So how are you guys this evening? How are you, Megalonyx? Long time no see. Oh, 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 I'm gonna crash, I'm gonna crash. Uh, stop. There we go. I hope everything is well with you. Have you been streaming much recently? I haven't been able to catch any anybody's streams. Um, I've been trying to catch up with, you know, some friends here and there, but um, I've not even been able to catch up with Morph Morph Twenty streams, and I'm a bit disappointed about that. But he understands. Crusader Kings 2 proper racist game. Alright. 
Yeah, but that's sort of the times, isn't it? If they're trying to be, I think they're trying to be as um, as close to realistic as possible. And those sort of times, I suppose there was quite a bit of racism. Oh wait a minute! Did I just? I oh, put that barrel down there. Maybe there's another one over here. Ah, there is another one over here. Yay! Okay, let's pop that this one in. Oh, that's not a hole. I thought it was going to be a hole. Okay. There we go. Oh. Wait, where are you going, dude? Because the, the brakes on. You see that? The brakes on. Oh, what's that popping down? Hello. Oh, what is that? Go up here. I get it. It's like a welder. I can fix the button. <gasps> yeah. Let's write this down, shall we? I am. Hey. Alright, maybe I can start fixing bits of the ship. Put the brakes on a second, buddy. Let's do some fixing repairs first. Here we go. Does it look like I wanted you to go? I put the brakes on! Right, here we go. What's nope? You haven't been streaming at all, have you? Oh. I don't think that fixed it at all. Did not fix it. I think because I'm behind the wall there. Maybe it didn't register. Let's put the brakes on a second. It uses up my energy doing that. There we go, now that's worked. No streaming. Oh, right, you've given it up completely now, have you? Where are you from then, uh, Bobby Fat Gun? Are you an American that knows about the Daily Mail or are you British? And... Look at that. So cool this game. <laughs> He's German. Oh dear. <laughs> You've got your own set of problems at the moment, then, haven't you? You're all running scared that Britain's decided to go it alone. <laughs> uh. Seems every German I speak to is like, you really got to stay in Britain. No, that was a really bad German accent. <laughs> Airstrip one. I can't do German accents. That much has been proven. We. Oh no, don't stop, 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 stop. Okay, cool. Right. There we go up. So there's a button up here for us to press. Whoa, missed that. A German 
you is <laughs> not much is true, my friend. Not much is true. <laughs> I, I've only actually met like two actual Germans in my time and both of whom are very like prim and proper type chaps I mean I'm, I'm not exactly a chap that's not prim and proper but uh, they were very much a oh yes got to be sensible that's I'm so bad at the German Oh, I see. I've got to tune. Have I got to tune this in? Ah. Nice. Yeah, some good music there. Very um, ye olde music. Let's throw some light over here. There we go. Serious <laughs> Poppy Watch. Oh no, I've got a barrel there. Just use that. Yeah, do do. Oh, no. This kind of music reminds me of. Um, uh, games like uh, Bio. Um, what's it called? Oh man, my brain's gone dead. Bio watch, bio. Here we go. Bioshock, thank you. Thank you, Bobby. For some reason just <laughs> wouldn't come to my mind. Uh, go, that's it. Do, do. I think we probably need some more energy. Keep ourselves topped up. I'm <laughs> going to the wedding tomorrow. Uh, yes, well, they did send me. They did send me an invite, but I uh, decided not to. I thought it might be a bit too public. <laughs> And all that dancing, oh my god. I hate weddings. <laughs> Received a pronunciation. <laughs> oh look, the wind's up. Oh, we can, we can save ourselves a bit of energy here. The wind's up. I just noticed that. There we go. Pop our sails out. There we go. I like this, you see. This is my favourite bit. When the sun's out, we can just sit on the deck of our ship and watch the world go by. There's a sort of appearance in this game of slight desolation as well as uh, life here and there. It's like if you have a look, these farms look like they're proper lived in. But it also looks slightly desolate. So I'm not sure whether they're going for that. Or not.
The Blue. The Blue Isles. A fresh start. Yeah. Seems nice enough. Let's get some energy in. What's we here? Oh no! No, we're going to crash into something. I oh, know. Okay, all right. Yeah. Uh, oh, let's put some energy in, just in case we need it. Yeah, we get set on fire. Oh, that was a. Uh... Sorry. Didn't mean to break your fence. I'll pay for it. Oh, wait a minute. We'll take the sails down. Otherwise, we're going to crash. Oh. Here we go. Uh, reminds me of that shit YouTube video once where this dumbass was trying to say made in chat is a proper example of proper no 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 very few people actually speak in received pronunciation and those people that do I tend to be tend to be royal class and speak in manners such as this not that I know really how to speak, receive pronunciation. I give it a good go. No, I get called. I get actually in in terms of my area where I come from. I get uh, sort of home wise. I get called um, posh by a lot, by a lot of people, but actually, I'm not that posh um, in terms of where I grew up. So where I live is different from where I grew up. Where I grew up, I, I would be one of a few people that uh, actually I would speak quite badly in terms of where I grew up. To be fair, oh naff. Did I just blow it? No, see that's what I say, but the common folk all think <laughs> they all seem to think I'm posh. <laughs> but no, I'm not I'm not that posh. Loving the music. Why wouldn't you vote for Trump? <laughs> wouldn't it be a very wasted vote now? Because he's at, he actually won, didn't he? say I probably wouldn't would have voted for Trump myself given your choices there wasn't really much of a choice was there
you had a choice between a rock and a hard place. And I think had you chosen Hillary, you would have chosen a very hard place. Oh look, we got winds up. Let's see if we can get the sail done. Okay, Bobby is an ardent May supporter. We're just going off the last thing about amazing if she's going to make Brexit. Oh my god! Are you serious? No way, but Jose. That woman wouldn't know a deal if it bit her in the ass. We need her out. problem is the only opposition she's going to get is Corbyn and he's just as bad. None of them seem to have a freaking clue what they're doing. I mean, you may as well have somebody like like Trump in, really, because nobody really knows <laughs> what they're doing. Democrat, public. Uh. Oh wait, wait, wait! Let me get the sails down. Oh balls! Stop! 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 All right. Burkow. Possibly. I have to limit myself on the uh, on the p politics because I could go on all night and that's going to be no fun for anyone. I'm chatting away about politics the whole time. It's just going to be a yawn fest. I just think we're sort of at a position now where Britain needs its own its own Trump as it were. You know, somebody to shake things up, somebody to put a fork in the uh, status quo and see whether they're ripe enough. Because I think uh, politics is uh, going to suffer with some pretty dramatic issues over the next few years. No, no, no. No, no, I need to get back to my... Let me go, let me go. PMQs are exciting. <laughs> I'm with, I, I'm with uh, Bobby on this one, mate. <laughs> you tell him, Bob. Oh, my ship's done. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, look at that in the background. That's pretty cool. Oh, nobody's ever going to trust Boris. Same as they've never trust uh, uh, what's his face again. 
Nigel Farage. Tony Blair? Oh, I think that, that ship sailed. Except for some reason, every time there's like a political crisis, they, they call on Tony Blair for a comment. It's like, really? Like the last guy you want commenting on a political crisis, especially in the last couple of years, is a convicted war criminal. You know, well not convicted, but you know what I mean. I'm gonna have to repair something here. Yeah, but the thing is, it's not him that's off his head. It's it's the people around him that seem to think he's he, his the shit he says actually makes any difference or actually means something now. You know, after what he did and what Bush did. I think anybody that looks at those guys and thinks, ah, oh, you know, they're great, you know, let's get a political commentary from them, you know, they obviously know what they're talking about and what they're doing. Oh yeah, amazing. Yeah, they killed hundreds of thousands of people um, over misinformation and told the country shit that didn't actually happen. And Oh uh, yeah, they, they tricked us all, but that's okay, we'll get them for political commentary. Yep, yeah. yeah, no, 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 you're gonna get me started and it's gonna be bad and people are gonna die. <sighs> Mega, we're not talking about politics anymore. <laughs> You too, Bobby. Let's stop talking about politics because then the the tin floor hat comes out and it will all go to, it will all go to pot and this stream will end up being me believing that somebody's out to kill me. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Nick uh. Drake. Who's Nick Drake? Oh no no! Oh wow, that was a bit of a heavy hit. Uh, I've got to repair something now. I don't vote. No, I don't vote either. Um, the only thing I've actually voted on in the last, well, actually since I got the right to vote. Um, has been the Brexit. That was the only thing I've ever voted on. Because that was the only thing that worth voting on, to be fair. <laughs> yeah. No. I did not. I vote to remain. But I could understand why we voted to leave. I can understand why it happened. How it happened. And uh, I think uh, I think having seen the repercussions of our vote and how the um, how the EU have thrown their toys out the pram and acted like such children over it, I think we're better out. I think we've made the right decision. I don't think it's worth us even worrying about it. EU will be a thing of the past very shortly, and we can all. Uh, sleep safely because when the world 
because when uh, when things go to pot and uh, the EU decide that they're going to start enforcing things with their army, that's when they're going to have people in the streets and shit is going to get heavy, man. I promise you that it's all going to go fucking pitong. What's that? Shit, you were going to work there, though. Do you go to work there, do you? Uh, they're formulating, they're forming a um, European army. An EU uh, European army. Basically, the reason why we wanted to stay, we 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 joined the common market was for the market itself. It wasn't for this European Union. And over time, the market has changed from being one of just a um, central trading hub to one of almost like a United States of Europe and uh, we never wanted that that was never the intention of of um, the reason why we joined and we've been people have been fighting for years for a, a vote to to leave um, and uh, you know they finally got it and I think it was only it was only a matter of time nobody really wanted to be a part of a union of Europe, um, but they plastered it all as like, oh, we're safer together. Oh, yeah. We're safer together. Oh, if we leave the EU, there's going to be wars and all sorts of stuff. Not actually mention the fact that there's already a lot of wars being caused by the EU. There. Anyway, safer together, dude. Safer together. That's what they said. I don't know. I'm I'm babbling. Ooh, shit. I'm talking about the EU and the politics of the EU, that's what I'm talking about. I don't know what. Explain. Don't just say I don't know. You have to explain. Educate me, sir. I'm well open to being educated. Bollocks here. I don't care. What do you mean I don't care? What's I care? Don't tell me whether I care or not. It's not up to you to decide. I care, sir. Just what I care for it may be different to what you care about. To be honest, there's so much misinformation about the whole thing. It's very difficult. It's very difficult to to grasp through all the politics what the reality of what we're facing is. What the reality of the of the um, of the situation is with the EU, you know, because we get told one thing, we get shown another, and, and in reality, it doesn't actually work out like that. 
you know, the EU have a lot of fingers in pies that they're that they're uh, that they shouldn't have, as far as I'm concerned. But I think I think in terms of the EU, I think we should have a, a centralised government across Europe. But I just don't think the, e the European Union, as it stands today, is going to be that government, or should be that government. It's, it should be reformed, and they were clearly not keen to reform the old boys club, that's for sure. And after they've thrown their toys out of the pram like a bunch of little girls about the fact that we're leaving, demanded this and demanded that and wanted money off of us, it's like, nope. No, nope. you've lost any sympathy from me about that. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tony. <laughs> away from the uh, political chat and talk about the game how amazing this game is it is just so like pretty don't really know how to explain it really did any of you did any of you get to play journey on the um, on the PlayStation? Missing out. Probably one of the better games on PlayStation that I've ever played. Um, just very similar to this in terms of simplicity and artistic. Uh, you know the, the way the uh, the art is is drawn and it was it was just a game that you could sit down and relax to, and it would be a journey that you would go through, and you would. You would see uh, your character develop over time. But really, this is very much similar in, in, in terms of that. And um, artistic style is very much there. Yeah, I mean, it's not exactly the same, don't get me wrong. They're very different, but they're also very much like the same. It's difficult to explain until you've played it. If you see what the difference you see what the differences are, and the similarities in terms of the way they play. That swimming game? What swimming game is that?
Alright, I haven't seen that one. Let's have a look. Oh god, Journey was like uh, 2000, 2012, really, that's that long ago, I didn't realise it was that long ago. It's called That Game Company. Abzu. Oh, wait a second. What am I doing here? There we go. Let me, give me a second. Let me just fill up my tank. I thought I saw that on Steam the other day. Is that on, is that on the PC? Yeah, Microsoft Windows. Oh, right, yeah. I think I saw that on Steam for sale the other day. I take it you liked it. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Too busy staring at my screen. Don't blow up. I think I might have to release some of this Steam, otherwise. There you go, might blow up. Is that, is that your uh, opinion of it? Three stars then? Three stars is fairly good. Or is that three stars out of ten? <laughs> Oh look! Oh, I think I can replace my wheels. Mm. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna take the old wheels off first. Yeah. Cool. That's cool. I suppose I'll do that to get these wheels here. Yeah? There, we're back down. And we got some new wheels, boys! Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, I got some new wheels, man. I got some new wheels. Yeah, man. Check me out, son. Slim Shady, hotter than a set of twin babies. Here we go. Oh wait a minute, what's that? Oh my how energy things changed. Does that mean I've got more energy? Or oh. the energy's funner? Uh So what time is it um, where you are, Megalonyx? Nowadays, everybody want to talk. Let me got some to say when another comes out with a new lips. Just a bunch of gibberish. And motherfuckers that they forgot about me. Sixty 
see. Oh, that's all right. It is currently 20 past 12 here. And in 10 minutes, I'm going to have to stop the stream and go to bed. Oh, I'm really going quite quickly on this one. Oh, energy, 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 energy. Oh, what have we got? Flamer, flamer, flamer! Ugh. Jesus. Uh, that's interesting. Can't go any further. Uh, best put that brake on before I reverse somewhere I shouldn't. Doesn't seem to be anywhere to go. The only thing is to use the sails, I suppose. Well, that wasn't obvious. That flag wasn't working. It's weird. So, how did you like Abzu then? Has anybody else played Abzu? I was thinking about getting it the other day. I've been really into these indie games recently, and um, the more I play them, the more I realise just how much they remind me of, you know, games from my childhood that that we really, you know, you spent more time enjoying than than raging at, like things like Battlefield One and stuff like that, where you just sort of, well. Me personally, I spend a lot of my time raging at and getting more and more angry. And these games are just so simple, so fun to play. I see a lot of reviews actually on this game where people are complaining about the fact that there's only about three and a half, four hours of gameplay in it. I think, you know, we. Oh, fuck. Oh. I think we've put an awful lot of uh, pressure on developers to come up with lots and lots of hours of gameplay. One of my favourite games of all time has got to be um, uh, the Born a game that they came out with after the Born Identity came out with. That uh, came out, the one on the Xbox, and that only had like three or four hours of gameplay, but it was really good, uh, really simple, nothing, nothing major in terms of game mechanics. Um, but you just played through a storyline that was well, you know, fairly well written and, and, and fairly decent. And I just think we put a lot of pressure on developers to um, to do more with their games than they need to. I mean, this game's on Steam right now, eleven pounds, eleven pounds. I don't know what that's in dollars, like eighteen dollars maybe, like maybe probably yeah, probably about eighteen dollars. And I think for eighteen dollars, for eighteen, for eleven pounds, right? It cost me to go to the cinema uh, to see Deadpool two this week. It cost me like ten pounds for the ticket, and it was two hours of film. And I'll, ne I'll never get to see that film again, otherwise, I, unless I unless I buy the DVD, which I probably will. No, me. Um, But this game you get to play over and over again, you get to enjoy an experience that's otherworldly and you know, I don't think three and a half hours of gameplay for ten pound is too bad, really. A lot of people bang on about Yeah. How games have to look triple A and how games have to give you value for money it's like, 
Well, if you can't see the value for money in a game that's eleven pounds, um, and it gives you three and a half hours of solid, fun gameplay, then you're just not going to see the value in any game, really. Right, what am I meant to do here? Guessing something interesting. Am I meant to knock this over? I think I might have to knock this over. Ah, oh, balls. How do I reverse? going the other way so I don't think it's worth putting the sails up. Break here for a bit. The hail goes off. I don't know whether it's going to damage my ship or not. Very ominous music. That doesn't look promising. Push through it, buddy. Let's go. Quick, quick. Let's stop up some repairs here. Let's go. I don't know whether this weather is like contextual, whether you just have to go through it and it'll stop when I go through it, or whether if I can hide under there until it's gone, I don't know. Come on, let's get through this storm. Yeah, I think it's positional, I think it just goes until get for it. Contextual is what I meant. Right, I'm on fire now. I wonder if I just leave it burning. Hmm. 
Well, that looked fairly cool. I think I was getting injured there. I don't seem to have a health bar there. I think I might have to go over that wall. Right, okay guys, well that I'm gonna leave it there for this evening. And I shall catch you later. Thank you for joining me on this live stream. And um, I hope you enjoyed yourself.